Okay, I'm doing a quick video for people looking for trainer kites. Uh, put this video together to help you with your decision process. Uh, when I was looking for trainer kites, I'm the type of person that researches the heck out of everything. I call dealers, I call manufacturers, I call anyone and everyone that knows anything about the sport or the product or the service I'm looking for and I ask them all types of questions. I did the same thing with the kites and pretty much they told me the same thing. Most of the kites are all the same, provided you're looking at the same price point. So what should you buy? If they're all the same and there's really not much difference if you're comparing apples to apples, do you go with the best deal? Or do you go with you know a certain brand because someone else says it's better or reviews or, or what? I mean, so I would look at the most full featured trainer kite that you can afford and then go for the best deal out there. Now, with us, we believe the three line is the best to go for, period. I mean, if you can afford it, the three line is what you want to get. Um, if you can afford the HQ Hydra 350 or 300, that's what we would recommend. I mean, as it's the best all around kite for everything. So, again, three lines is best. And I'll tell you what we offer. When you buy from us, we give you up to $180 of free stuff with your trainer kite purchase. For instance, we give you $20 uh, value in free shipping. We give you a free anemometer, which is a wind meter, which is a $30 value. It's something you definitely want. We give you a free mystery gift, which is a $20 value. We give you two DVDs. One is Kiteboarding 101 and one is Space Monkeys 2. Both of them are $30 values. You get both of those with the purchase of most of our trainer kites. Uh, we give you a 110-day return policy. We give you a 110% price protection guarantee, and we give you free kite buggy plans worth $50, and actually worth more than that, but we had to put a value on it, so we chose 50 bucks. So why are we doing all this? Because we choose to serve the best. I, I've subscribed to the business belief that he who serves best makes the most money, and in the long run, it has never failed me, and we're doing the same thing with these kites. So. Uh, if you're asking why I'm doing this, it's for one simple reason, because I believe in giving the most value for the money uh, and we back it up with service. So uh, trainer kite brands, the main ones out there are HQ, Ozone, Slingshot, Sensei, Best Trainer, there's Flex Foil, there's quite a few others, but those are the main ones. Uh, what you got to have with a trainer kite, must have, is a safety leash system. They come with carrying bags, launch weights, a wind meter, some training DVDs of some type or manuals, and of course our free mystery gift. Um, the other question people have is should I get a three line or a two line? Well, again, we say get a three line because there is ease of relaunch, you will fly it more often, and it works as a D power line. So definitely want to go for a three line. A two line, well, people buy a two line for one reason and pretty much one reason alone, and that's to save money because most two line kites are entry level kites and they're very simplistic in design. Uh, what brand should you buy? Well, HQ Power Kites is what we chose to carry. Uh, Ozone is also a good brand. Sensei Kites and Slingshot are the other ones that are kind of the mainstream. Uh, again, we chose the HQ. Uh, the top models are pretty much all the same, so you're pretty much kind of looking at uh, the coloring and the graphics on the kite and then the brand and what kind of deal you get. Uh, again, safety leash is a must. The Slingshot B2 does not have one, so I wouldn't recommend getting that one. HQ Power Kites uh, all use top grade materials. They have many, many price points to choose from. Uh, they both come in two line and three line configurations. They have the Hydra and all of their kites come with a safety leash system. So the first line, uh, or the second to the top, is the HQ Rush 4 Pro. Now they use top quality uh, materials. Uh, they have uh, Dyneema bridle lines. They have color coded bar, which is red and blue for left and right. They do come with a safety leash system. They are three line kites, and they have three ch uh, sizes to choose from. 3.5 meter, 2.8 meter, and a two meter. Now the Rush 4, is exactly the same as the Rush 4 Pro, but it's a two-line kite, and they don't use the Sone Dyneema bridles on this one, but they're still high-quality lines. All of these kites are ready to fly. They're already connected, uh, so there's nothing you have to do. I mean, just take it out, unfold it, take it out of the bag, and it's ready to go. Uh, it comes in three sizes as well, and again, they're two-line kites. 
Now the Hydra, this is the top of the line trainer kite across the board. There is no one that makes a kite like this. It has sewn Dyneema bridle lines and again these lines are color coded. They have red and blue which match up with the red and blue on the bar for left and right. So if a kite gets uh, tangled, it's much easier to untangle these lines than it is on kites that have the same color lines are pretty much all white or gray and it's hard to tell which ones are what. So comes with a wrist safety strat, uh, leash system. They are three lines. Uh, they have two uh, sizes to choose from, which is a 3.5 meter and a 2.6 meter. And again, the Hydra is the only kite that you can use in the water and uh, do relaunches and training and body drags and that type of stuff in the water or fly it near the water. So um, the HQ Symphony TR is an entry level line, which is kind of similar to the Slingshot B2. Uh, very good quality material. Uh, it's not going to have all the features and stuff that the other, you know, kites will have. It won't take, you know, as much abuse long term as the others. But again, you know, uh, it's at a much, much lower price point. So two lines, two sizes, uh, 1.7 and 1 1.3. Uh, the Ozone Ignition Trainer Kite, comparable to the Rush uh, 4 Pro, which is a three line uh, version, comes with the same type of uh, bridle lines, color coded bar safety lease system uh, but they come in four sizes so you know if you want uh, the ozone brand and you want it in a smaller 1.6 they're going to offer that whereas the hq doesn't but in all honesty most people never really go below a two meter unless they have really really young kids that they're trying to get into it and then if they do they usually get a symphony to be honest with you because it's a lot less money and it comes in a 1.3 so it's even smaller uh, or 1.7 then you have the Ozone Imp Trainer, which is the same type kite as the Rush 4, which is a two-line kite. And again, everything pretty much the same, except for they come in four sizes, so they offer something down into the 1.3 meter, like the Symphony. So, But a little bit more money, so you could go with the Symphony and save money as well there. So good kites, though. Uh, Ozone makes some really good stuff. The Ozone Quattro is a four-line trainer kite. It's kind of in its own league. It's not really what most people get into when they first started out with a trainer, but we thought we'd tell you about it. And again, it comes in four uh, sizes, and um, it's handles instead of a bar. But it is a four-line kite, which means you have brake lines on it. Uh, the Slingshot B2 we told you about before. We don't really recommend them, not because we don't carry them, but because it doesn't come with a safety strap, uh, and it only comes in one size, two meter, and it's a two-line kite. So it's it's a very simple uh, entry level. So we would recommend the HQ Rush 4 or even as low as the Symphony uh, TR 1.7, and about the same amount of money, but you get a lot of free extras with that. Um, then you have the Slingshot B3, which is an upgrade from the B2. The main difference is it's bigger at 3 meters, and it comes with a wrist strap uh, safety leash. Then there's other trainer kite brands out there. Um, again, Sensei, Flexfoil, um, uh, the other ones I mentioned on there, you know, of course, everyone makes a trainer kite. Some companies only make the upper end kites. So, again, what you're looking for is a three-line trainer kite. If you can afford the Hydra, that's what we'd recommend. Everyone we that that has the ability to, to spend at that level should get the Hydra. Next step would be the HQ Rush 4 Pros, which are also three-line kites, uh, and then the HQ Rush 4. And again, keep in mind, we offer more free stuff with every trainer kite than any other shop out there. So when you do the numbers and do the math, you are gonna get a much, much better deal buying through us and getting the freebies and again we do this because in every business I start and every type of service I offer I always go the extra mile and I provide people with unbridled value no one can compete with me on this and um, I'm usually the leader when it comes to that so hopefully this video helped you I'll try and produce some more I have some videos and I'll do some stuff uh, like review videos but check out our website uh, www.trainingkite dot net or hqpowerkites.net both of those are my sites uh, check them out uh, we have them uh, ready to go and shipped usually you'll get them within a week unless we're uh, back stock or uh, back ordered 
uh, and, and unless we're out of some of the freebie stuff that we give and we have to get more in. But um, again, you get everything all at once in one package. We send it all to you. So when you get, open up your box, you get all the free stuff and the kite. And uh, if you have any problems, we, we have a 110 day no questions asked return policy for whatever reason. If you don't like it, just send it back. We'll, we'll credit you back your, uh, your, um, your purchase. So thank you for listening uh, and check out our site.